Brazil is a country of rich and diverse culture, with influences from indigenous, African, European and other peoples. One of the most fascinating aspects of Brazilian culture is its folklore, which is full of myths and legends about supernatural beings and phenomena that reflect the history, geography and identity of Brazil. In this video, we will explore some of the most popular and intriguing myths and legends of Brazilian folklore, and learn about their origins and meanings. Welcome to Curioverse, the channel where you can learn about the most fascinating facts and mysteries of the universe. If you enjoy this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this. Let's start with one of the most iconic and beloved characters of Brazilian folklore, Sachi Pereira. Sachi is a one-legged black boy who wears a red cap and smokes a pipe. He is a trickster who likes to cause mischief and prank people, especially farmers and travelers. He can disappear and reappear at will, create whirlwinds, change his shape, control animals and plants, and grant wishes to those who capture him or his cap. Sachi is also very knowledgeable about the secrets of nature and can heal diseases with his magic. Sachi's origin is uncertain, but some scholars believe he is a combination of indigenous, African and European elements. He may have been inspired by the Yachi Yater, a one-legged spirit from the Guarani mythology, by the enslaved children who lost their legs in the sugarcane plantations, or by the Moorish pirates who wore red caps as a symbol of freedom. Another famous character of Brazilian folklore is Iara, also known as May Dagua or Mother of Water. Iara is a beautiful mermaid who lives in the rivers of the Amazon rainforest. She has long dark hair, fair skin, green eyes and a fishtail. She sings a mesmerizing song that attracts men to her domain, where she seduces them and takes them to the bottom of the river. Once there, they become her lovers or slaves, depending on her mood. Iara was originally a warrior woman from an indigenous tribe who was betrayed by her brothers and thrown into the river. She was rescued by the spirits of the water, who gave her a new form and powers. Iara represents the beauty and danger of nature, as well as the female strength and sexuality. A third character that is very popular in Brazilian folklore is Carupira, also known as Caipora or Father of the Forest. Carupira is a forest spirit who protects the animals and plants from hunters and loggers. He has red hair, green teeth and backward feet that confuse his enemies. He can also imitate the sounds of animals and create illusions to lure or scare humans away from his territory. He sometimes rides a wild boar or a giant armadillo. Karupira is not evil, but he can be very vengeful if someone harms his domain. He may punish them by making them lose their way in the forest, stealing their weapons or belongings, or even killing them. Karupira is a manifestation of the indigenous respect for nature and its balance. A fourth character that is very common in Brazilian folklore is Boitada, also known as Baitada or Fire Snake. Boitada is a giant snake that lives in the rivers and forests of Brazil. It has fiery eyes that glow in the dark and can set things on fire with its gaze. It feeds on the eyes of dead animals or humans that it finds in its path. Boitada is also a guardian of nature that protects it from fire and deforestation. It can turn into a flaming log or coil around trees to prevent them from burning. It can also chase away those who start fires or cut down trees in its domain. Boitada is derived from an indigenous word that means, fiery serpent. It symbolizes the fear and awe that people have for fire and its destructive power. These are just some examples of the many myths and legends that are part of Brazilian folklore. There are many more characters and stories that reflect the diversity and richness of Brazil's culture and history. Some of them are regional, while others are national. Some are ancient, while others are modern. Some are humorous, while others are scary. But all of them are fascinating and captivating. We hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new about the myths and legends of Brazilian folklore. Which one was your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to Curioverse for more videos like this. Thank you for watching and see you next time.